Hey y'all, it's Liz. Hey, today I did this look and I'm going to call it semi-precious black. Yeah. Um, it's using like um, blacks and burgundies and um, a little bit of just a hint of orange. So yeah, so um, if you like this look and you want to see how I did it, just continue to watch. I'm going to do this. I'm going to post it as a prom look. So if you're wearing a black gown or a burgundy gown, this would surely work. Okay, and um, I didn't show uh, my highlight color in the the one that's going to be following this one, the next clip, but it's Dalliance from MAC. But you can use any kind of highlight that you want. But yeah, so this is the look. I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial and you try it out. And um, yeah, I like it. It's just a really dark, um, smoky look. All right, well, you guys have a great day, and I will be seeing you guys soon. Bye. Hey, y'all, if you're ready to get started with this look, let me tell you what we used today. Um, as a primer, I used Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Um, as a base for my lid only, I used uh, Physician's Formula Gel Liner in Black to put down as a base. Um, in my crease and above, working up towards my brow, I used um, Sexpectations from MAC, which is this burgundy color. And then to darken my crease, um, I used uh, Semi Precious by MAC, which is this one. Uh, and I mixed it with the Makeup Forever number no. 4 in black, just to give it a really deep, dark crease. Above that, um, Sexpectations. I used an orange blush and I just kind of blended it out to give it a little bit of a um, uh, orange highlight. On my lid I used Carbon by MAC which is this really black color and then uh, on the inner half I used Black Tide by MAC to give it a little bit of a sparkle. For my lashes I used um, the Falsies and then um, I also used this uh, black, again, this gel liner to line my upper and lower lash line. And then uh, for my lips, I lined my lips with the um, NYX Jumbo Pencil and Narcisse 723. And then on top of that, I used Wet n Wild's um, Pixie, which is this color here. And that's it. So that's the look for today. Um, if you guys want to see how it's done, just continue to watch. Okay, so if you're ready to get started with this look, I've already primed my lid and I used, um, for a base, I used the Physician's Formula um, in black. Right here. And um, I put that just on my lid and I kind of blended it upwards to kind of fade out. So the first color that we're going to go in with is a, um, a light burgundy color. And I'm using the um, Sexpectations by MAC. And what I'm going to do with that is basically create um, a cut crease and work it up just a little bit. Just like so. And I put the tape on so I could get a crisp line. Um, there we go. Just like that. Same with the other eye. And we're just going to work that up towards the brow. Okay, so that's what it looks like so far. Then the next color we're going to go in with is going to be um, Semi Precious by MAC. And it's a deeper um, burgundy. But it's not really, really dark, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to add on the tip of this um, the Makeup Forever number 4, which is a black. And I'm just trying to darken 
that um, semi-precious color and just kind of work that just in the crease. Just like so. And then I'm going to go in with my makeup um, blush um, from the um, BH Cosmetics um, palette, blush palette. And I'm going to take this orange color right here and I'm just going to fade that on top of that um, burgundy at the top. And if you lose um, some of that burgundy and you want to go back in, you can do so. And then I'm just going to work it up. I have a contrast of colors here. Okay. Um, and I am going to go back in with that, um, that first color, that uh, uh, Sexpectations by MAC. And between the semi-precious and the black and that, that one there. We're just going to go right back over it again. Because I just want a hint of that orange just to kind of give it like a highlight color there. Yes, pumpkin. <clears throat> you finna leave me? Yeah. All right. Uh, Are you going to run to the... Hold on for a minute. Okay, so now we're going to go in with carbon, and that's going to go on our lid, and we're going to keep it under the crease. We don't want to go above the crease with this carbon. It just We just want to put this just on our lid. And again, don't go above the crease with this um, carbon. Okay, that's what it looks like so far. I'm going to go back in with my um, blending brush and where I put that um, semi-precious and that Makeup Forever Black Eyeshadow together. I'm just going to blend this with the, the black a little bit so it's not like a hard line between them. And I'm just going to work that like that. Okay. Now I'm going to go in with, um, it's a sparkly black color right here. And I'm just going to take a little bit of that, pick it up on my brush, And I'm going to place that right on the inner half, or the just on the inner. So there's a little sparkle there. Same with the other eye. And it's like, uh, it's a matte, it's, it's a matte color. I don't remember the name of it, but it's black with the little sparkles in it. Okay. And that's what I'm going to do with that. So I'm going to remove, well, let me go ahead and do my lower lash line right quick. And I'm going to go in with, um, that, um, Sexpectation from MAC again. And I'm just going to place that on the inner. Just like so. And where is my thing here? 
I'm going to line my lower lash line right quick with um, this physician's formula. Um, I should have did that before I put that uh, semi-precious on. I got fallout everywhere. Just under the lash line, like so. And then I'm going to take um, that carbon and I'm going to place that on top of that liner that I just put on. You can also use a, a black eyeliner pencil and then place the carbon on top of it. Okay. Now I'm going to go in with Sexpectations and I'm going to apply that underneath this black. Just like so. And then I'm going to remove the tape from my eye, I think, yeah, damn near pulled my damn eye off, shit, okay, I got a little glitter in my eye, I'm going to take a brush and Um, use some powder and dust off this excess that fell on my face. And I'm going to do that and I'm going to line everything up and I'll be right back. So don't go anywhere. Okay, y'all, I'm back with a final look and um, this is it. And I didn't say it in the other video where I showed you the products that I used, but I used um, Dalliance from MAC as a highlighter. Um, yeah, it's kind of sparse, but anyways, this is the final look, so let me just give you a close-up of it, and this is what it looks like, yeah, that's it, so that's the look for today, and, um, let me just show you Dalliance, it's, uh, from the Mega Metal, and it's this color right here, and I used that as a highlighter. Um, I didn't put any blush on, but oh well. Yeah, so this is the look. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and um, you try this look out. All right, you guys have a good one. Bye.